All right, welcome back to more Warhammer 40k Rogue Trader. This is episode number five. And when we left off, we just met the uh, guy that was possessed. And yeah, it's been about a week since I last played. I ended up recording that last session and then coming down with a flu and haven't recorded since then. So yeah, I'm better now, obviously. And we are going to be playing plenty more of this. So let's. Dive back in and see what we can do. Open this door. The door is closed with a lot less intact. Probably it can probably be opened with the right tool. Alright, so let's take a look at our journal real quick. A servo skull from the warning chamber is relayed to Eos with the message. The air of the live and gathering people loyal to the dynasty to storm the bridge. It is vital to make it to this meeting to unite force Edelthred and confront Coonrad. Did you want something? And here we are. The Emperor is Oh, we're us. in battle. Oh. None of them. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah, there's seven enemies. I could always just look up there and I forget to do that, so let's kind of do what we can. Alright, start the battle. Without deeds is worthless. A nice burst fire there that went really good. We got three guys that are basically down. Doubt is for the weak. Furious recital, which grants our momentum equal to six. Ow. You miss me? Nothing. A tactically sound approach. At your back and call. I will do my duty. Okay. We've got four almost dead guys here. Actions will speak louder than words. Wow, okay, I miss. I can't allow myself to do this. Well, we're going to take some damage here. <laughs> Alright, Adira. I'd love to be able to do that, but that's gonna friendly fire. Not this guy's job. But of course, he's gone. All right, one down. I refuse. God Emperor, move through me. Be the ah. fire in my heart. Okay, at least we missed him. Someone else can do this. Only one HP. 
Victory reduce the dust. Or another one bites the dust. At your beck and call. Another one bites the dust. We're down to three. Oh, here comes reinforcements. We're back right after seven. <laughs> All right, well. Move me and see what we can do. I am the chosen weapon that will crush the heathens. I will not be deterred. Your corrupt way has Well we took one out, so I think that's probably a pretty good use of our and so stuff. It shall be done. Give Adira this buff. Was the command buff? Maybe I should have went for the assailant. They're gonna go here. Assailant, assailant. Who's gonna go here? This this guy with one HP is gonna go. Oh, my ears are ringing. Let's see, can I do a good thing here? We'll do. An unfortunate turn of fate. Yeah, I can. That went really good. <gasps> was, was that Analyze? you? Analyze. Or... On it. For warning. And we're in a much better spot than we were 30 seconds ago. Injuries will not slow. To use our medic kit. As the Emperor commands. <laughs> Another one down. And we have two of our guys that are ready to make a move before the others can, and that's gonna really help us out here. My place is at the fall. That's not the Seneschal's job. Yeah, neither of them are close enough for him. Rejoice in service. I will step in towards our ultimate victory. Alright, so we're just down to two. One behind the table, and one over there. The only attack option I had. I didn't want to use a attack that much or that powerful for him, but I had really no choice. Guided by faith. And there we are. We are bound by the blood of marshes. What do we got over here? The cozy seating area is completely destroyed. Pieces of furniture and splinters are scattered everywhere and dark stains cover the floor and upholstery. Let us walk this path to the end. Pretty big battle there. Let's see what's in open. here. The damned heretics have blocked the door, trembling at the thought of our approach. By the right of blood. There's probably one around here somewhere. The door leading to the main promenade is sealed shut. Explosives will be able to deal with this obstacle. 
blow the door up. Let the faith guide my path to glory. In order to open, unlock, or lock doors, clear rubble, coerce machine spirits, and overcome other challenges, you can also use consumable items. We shall reclaim what is rightfully ours. The cogitator is silent. It seems that the machine spirit is no longer being powered by the motive force. Know your duty. Does anyone have explosives? We are bound by the blood of martyrs. Did I mention that my whispers tell me jokes? Jokes that once the meant. Emperor protects. What advice do you seek? No suffering will make me forget his no. sacred word. When the faithful are idle. No one has any of it. Onward. To open a jam door, click on the icon. The character with the highest tech use will make the skill test. Alright, so this is the jam door. Let's bring everyone else down. So divine watches over us. Accomplished. Alright, so we are in With this room, and I think I there's explosives in here somewhere. Among the stars. Servo skull anti gravitic impeller. Anointed. All of these we're going to collect all. We'll pack them as cargo. We got three melted charges. That's what we need. We also have some operator gloves. So I'm gonna equip on my own character. Let us walk this path to the end. All right. So we've gotten what we need out of there. Myself. And we're blown up and into the room. Game the auto saved. My path to glory. We all can level up, so let's go ahead and do our level ups. I know how I'm supposed to do this and I'm not able to do it. Avalard. We'll wait on that for we now. We shall reclaim what is rightfully ours. Catechism of Saint Drusus, fifteen percent of holy gifts cargo. Let's go through the door. Uh, tech use. Someone has the highest I tech use here. Repent. Okay, well. Blessed is father. Your seneschal is always there for you. Yes. We're just getting unlucky here, bro. Fine. 
blow it to smithereens. No, your duty. Should I divine our next step? Join me in prayer. My faith is my shield. Okay, um... No way down. So the divine watch get out of here, is over us. I feel like that was a waste of a demolition charge. We are bound by the blood of Mars. The key to success. Remember to advance the level of your character and their companions. They always receive new abilities and talents and improve their skills and characteristics. Clicking the arrow symbol on the character's portrait to open the level up screen. To summary. Wait. All right. Endure complete. You want to expose weakness complete. And revel and slaughter complete. Dimensions and even the cognizator torments proper plays are stacked in a rough semblance of a barricade. We can't go that Let way, but we can go this way. The flame rings in your ears and the choking smoke makes you cough and gasp for air. You instinctively recoil from the scorching heat, wiping your face. A moment later, a hazy silhouette forms on the raging wall of fire. You are surrounded by ear splitting noise and screaming, yet you distinctly hear the sound of footsteps. Then you see the th figure walk out of the fire towards you. It is Theodora von Valencius. Her expression is calm, terrifyingly so for someone whose body is engulfed in an inferno. One of her hands is resting on the hilt of her power sword, the other is raised in an inviting gesture. Oh, you lost my heir. An apparition. A sorceress apparition. Trick rear the warp. Sister, you will lower your weapon. Despite his commanding tone, Abelard does not sound too confident. He is staring at the rogue traitor and you notice a muscle in his cheek twitching. Threatening the Lord Captain is outrageous. Aren't you in pain? Pain is but a reflection of one's weakness, Seth Santiago. To renounce weakness of spirit and pursuit of greatness is the only path to heights worthy of a rogue traitor. I can lead you out of these flames, show you a path, rid you of pain, and give you a weapon that you so you may defeat your enemies. Beside, your mouth begins to salivate. Each word Theodore speaks is like music to your ears. The entity that now dwells in the different recesses of your mind is pleading, begging, Demanding that you give her an immediate answer, and that answer can be nothing other than accepting it. Do not listen to this abomination. Seth, if you... If there is naught but his light in your heart, if you are resolute in your faith, then step into the flame. The Emperor protects. His faithful will not be deterred by either darkness or deceitful promises, nor will the fire burn those who carry the torch of faith in their soul. To the word with you. We need to follow Lady Theodora before we suffocate in this furnace. The people... Abelard looks back at the coughing and confused people around you. Seth, the few survivors in the middle deck, we must help the crew lead them out, find a way around. Then we'll miss our chance to meet up with it. Adira breaks off and starts coughing violently. Her knees buckle and she looks as she's about to fall. What are we waiting for? The Emperor will guide the righteous on their path. You take a step forward and the illusion breaks. A wave of excruciating pain crashes over you and Theodora's voice fades in the firestorm. You hear the voices of your companions calling you from behind and the screams of the weak dying in the inescapable blaze. Oh. 
the blinding inferno, the harrowing pyre, the all consuming storm releases you as you step a while out, barely able to stand on your feet. The blood is pounding in your ears, drowning out the world around you. Your eyes caked in soot and burnt eyelashes refuse to open. Free from the flame, you take two more steps before collapsing to your knees. The rush of blood in your temples and the horrible pain all over your scorched body cloud your mind before suddenly retreating as if driven away by some mighty will. A new strength spreads throughout your veins, and despite the wound, your body is once more ready for trials and struggle. You open your eyes and see a glow with warm light before you, the Aquila, the sacred symbol of the Imperium. In the next moment, you are struck with another realization. The repulsive presence, the one that has plagued your mind and the void fear wounded you, is gone. The fire seems to have burned the entity away without a trace. Master, can you hear me? Oh, you're alive. Which is more than I was expecting after what you just did. Praise the Emperor. We passed through the flames. Oh, how can this be anything but a portent? For so it is said that the Emperor will bless the worthiest and most steadfast in their faith. Behind Argenti, you see Idira doubled over in a fit of nausea. The rest of the people who were following you have withered away in the fire that continues to rage mere two steps away from you. The Emperor protects Seneschal. Indeed he does. Oh, if I hadn't seen it myself, I never would have believed. What happened to Lady Theodora? Did she follow us? She was a hologram. There was no Theodora, witch. There was an illusion, a temptation, a foul taint that tried to lead us astray. But he perceived its true nature. Is that right, Adepta Sanctimonious? What, we'll just pretend like we didn't see the Lord Captain standing there in the fire? Abelard, you tell her. Whatever it was, it matters no longer. Uh, your conduct is bordering on madness, or holiness. A path opened behind you, where one moment there was fire, the next only smoldering embers remain. But what am I saying? My eyes must have deceived me. Too much smoke for my lungs. Truly, would you have received wounds like these if there had been no fire? The wounds are merely a sign of a trial laudably past. It is something to be proud of, the same as decorations or badges of honor. 